You're good, you're good. Welcome onto the ship. You can stand up and see these lovely people, or you can sit down, whatever. Would you like to introduce Okay. Very lovely to see Oxford Circus car free. Lovely to see you, Oxford right. Circus Car Free. Thank you to everyone. I'm going to be reading Dia Angelos' novels. Dia Angelos' novels. Thank you for looking out for me. It was a pleasure to guess at you while you were at the lake of the critical condition with these bubbles, ripples, currents and patches of green floating bacteria. Studying a drifting bottle on its surface while musing about the existence of extraordinary persons, worse or not, who know why they're here. You already knew they were here. You had spotted these humans before, protecting all forms of life on the planet. There are many, so many, but at that moment they came to the absolute foreground, like an extreme close-up of laborious ants, building ideal cities, which once visited remain unforgettable, making you know that every single act matters, that you matter, we matter. You close your eyes and tuned into the impermanence of things organic. You were suddenly snatched away and propelled elsewhere. In this elsewhere, you felt as, you, as if you were orbiting around me in a space capsule, and you distinctly heard my strange and human way. You were bewildered to see millions of fragments from damn satellites and rockets orbiting the air, promising collisions with new ones, spreading out, travel ahead. Amongst the space junk, you recognize orbiting past, a flying airplane door, an ocean of splash, an ejection site. Puzzled, you lowered your head, and you were instantly stirred by how intensely blue I am. You tuned in and found me breathtaking. You were transfixed. But when you tuned in further, you were sickened to see plastic rivers, vast islands made out of plastic, poisoning, ocean life, shrinking and vanishing glaciers, asymmetric, asymmetrical segments of broken ice melting adrift on the Arctic Sea oil spills and dead coral reefs. You saw my scars and you saw vast flooded areas and apocalyptic ghost towns with their buildings in ruins. You saw cities of despair and wildfires and drones and abstract patterns lies that happened to be trenches. As you got closer to my surface, you heard the screaming from all this suffering and chaos. You saw shoals of corpses, and you saw starving, homeless, and displaced humans from all countries, and the bodies of all the extinct and endangered species. <laughs> You then heard, you then heard thousands of white children, now screaming, now chanting, marching by laborious ants to claim their stolen future. And there were thousands of white people or natives, and you wanted to be one of those children. And those yet to be born were also there. You wept at all this beauty and horror. You blinked, and I spun day into night. And you laughed the night. And 
remember the beauty of documentaries about luminous light forms on TV and all the strange and wondrous fauna, flora, insects and minerals you have come across in your life. And you've always been in awe of the sheer diversity of it all. And you wanted to protect me. And you wanted to make better, to repair, to heal, to re-enchant the world. And you wanted to become a luminous life form. And when you landed back on me, you opened your eyes and you knew why you're here. And once you knew, there was no unknowing. Thank you once again. Yours truly, Planet Earth.